Hey, what's going on, YouTube? So, we are at part three of my playthrough of Watch Dogs Legion, playing as Aiden Pierce in the main story. That is one hell of a mouthful, but this is uh, part three. Part two, or the last video on this series, was uh, we actually investigated one of the bombing sites for Zero Day, and we also did a little... A little uh, heist, kind of, sort of. No, nothing, nothing too crazy, like GTA type heist. Oh, this is a nice car. Don't mind if I do. And toggle music, just in case. Don't want to get copyright. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, continue with our story. Uh, so we gotta search for evidence at the new Scotland Yard. So let's go ahead and uh, get there. Again, Ubisoft. Come on. Why do I have the waypoint? It's so it's so dumb. You gotta waypoint this for, for what? It's just so stupid. All right, let's go ahead and just drive over there. Oh, that's a light pole. I know this is a Aston. This is supposed to be based off of Aston Martin because this game is set in England, and it's based off of Aston Martin, kind of like the Double Seven vibes. But honestly, this does look a lot like a uh, a Nissan 280Z, 240Z. Oh, okay. Watch it. I'm here. I don't get why, why, why uh, Aiden yelled like that, considering that was his fault. <laughs> it's almost like a uh, fourth wall breaking when you just yelled like that. That's fine. Alright, search for evidence in the new Scotland Yard. Okay. So, I'm not sure if I really showed it off in the last episode, but I did give. I did give Aiden a new outfit. I don't know why I keep on trying to call him Megan from Walking Dead for, but no, I did give Aiden a new outfit. Oops. Taking over the whole station. And the entire police service. But don't worry, if you're not pleased with your privatized goo squad, take your business across the street. Not a fan of cops, but I'll take them over the rent of soldiers. Not to worry, the only difference now is the uniform, assault weapons, and the fact they're motivated by profit over public service. Now, any record or information on the spider bot will be buried. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be kinda lazy with this and do the spider bot. I don't wanna like, I don't want this whole playthrough to be playing as Aiden Pierce controlling a spider bot for missions, but the spider bot does help a lot, like, with difficulties of missions. Uh, you know what? Screw it, yeah, let's just go ahead and play as Aiden Pierce. I never understood, like, leaving your spider bot right there, like, isn't that, like, evidence? It's like, not picking up your spider bot? Uh, that should kind of be required, you know? Alright. So, I can just go inside this building, but, like, I'm basically limited. So I, I can go inside the building, but I can't go past, like, that counter, pretty much. But I can hack these cameras, which is cool. I guess he's not going to turn that back on, that's stupid. He should probably be fired. Okay. Okay, that went way too far. Uh, let's... Let's do... Distract, I'm not trying to distract him, I'm trying to... You know what, what's up? Ooh, you know what? I can't disrupt him. What the hell? I can't distract him or disrupt him or anything. That's so stupid. Can I, like, just melee this guy? Jesus Christ. Alright. Hey, melee this person, too. Right. Anybody in here? I 
I guess we'll free this person. Alright, that's a mask. We don't really need the... No, I could've take, taken down the, uh... With this, I guess, but... Oh well. <sighs> okay. I'm, I've been playing a lot of Fallout 4 lately, so like, I'm kind of trying to get used to the controls. That's not good. Got reinforcers coming. Yeah, I'm like used to like the Fallout 4 controls. I've been playing that for about three days. Like, yeah, that's the only game I've actually been playing these past three days is Fallout 4. So it's like the controls are so different. Like GTA 5 and Watch Dogs, the controls are somewhat similar, but Fallout 4 and GTA and Watch Dogs are just 180 polar opposites. So now I gotta worry about reinforcements. How do I get in there? Is there like a door right here? No. How the hell? No. Nope. Okay. I think it's when the infinite. Yeah, I learned that the uh, special ability is actually like explosive ammo. Or it was at least in the DLC of the game. I guess it's like, I don't know, it increases the uh, damage when you shoot. Okay, what the hell is the point of that? Yeah, this is like a fucking like. This is like a rat maze, man. There's no way to get in and out. I'm trying to hijack the damaged spider bot. That, that bullet just pushed him. It didn't even actually like. He got shot in the back of the neck and just pushed him out of the way. It didn't actually like, do any act real. It did damage, but like. He got shot in the back of the neck. He would like collapse on the ground. Maybe get up, get up with GTA. But in this game, it just pushed him out of the way. Like, hey, what was that? It's like getting bit by a bug. What the hell is that? Uh, maybe I just used a camera to hack in there, I guess. That should have been my first thought, but it really looked like... It really looked like I was able to uh, get in that room. I don't know what the hell the problem is. Hijack. Oh, I feel so stupid. Oh my god. What what opening? Yeah, I can barely I can barely jump out of the fence. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! I'm used to the actual spider bot. This one is damaged and broken. You know, because you know, plot once. The plot needs it to be broken. I I generally thought I could have just gone up to the uh, spider bot is taking it instead of doing all this, but you know. <sighs> What's this? Right, okay, hopefully, please tell me. I know these like. Getting out of here is like supposed to be like super linear, but like I'm probably gonna get harder on myself to actually need it to be. That's all his mask. It might be recovered from Parliament. It might be the only thing left of it now. Maybe I gotta jump on that glass right there. Looks like it, yeah. <laughs> Are you serious? And of course someone is looking for a group. Kinda of I, I don't know why he does that. Like, they're not my best friend on Xbox. So I don't know why it makes like oh, so and so is looking for a group. A group. Like I don't care. Look for some bitches, bro. Can we, please? All right. Okay. There's a vent. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Of course. If that's not a vent, is it? Because that thing's blocked off. So. Oh man, the thing is so slow, man. Like, I get it's broken, whatever, but like, Jesus, man. 
It just like ruins the flow of a game with like missions like this, you know? Okay, jump. There we go, we got it. If I miss that, I will probably would have cried if I stopped doing it, but Alright, we're in the vent. Yeah, I'm just so used to Fallout 4 because I'm like I was about to hold down left trigger so I can light up the the events. I realized this is not Fallout 4. I would do a playthrough on that, but that game is stupidly long. And I started it last year. I started Fallout 4 last year, and then I stopped playing like midway through. I want to say the part where. Oh man, what part was it? Uh, I think it was when you meet the Institute. I think not the Institute. The Brotherhood of Steel. I know two different things, but like, I met the Brotherhood of Steel. Oh no no! It was when you had to uh, find the railroad at that old church. I didn't I didn't know what I was talking about. Like follow the red road thing, so I had to like look it up on YouTube of how to uh, do it. And then I met the railroad, and then I went inside the institute, and that's where I'm at right now. Like I have Piper as like my main companion, and I, I have like Max like friendship basically, and yeah like. That game is super long. There's so many endings to it. The Institute ending, the the Railroad ending, Minuteman ending. I'm kind of more of a Minuteman guy because, you know, it's like they they seem like the most decent human beings out of that entire game. Like, they're, they're faction. Like, they're helping people. Just help people, you know? They're not help people because they gain anything from it. Can I jump? <sighs> you see, I wouldn't, I wouldn't completely hate this mission if, like, the spider. I get, I get the spider bot's broken because it, it survived the explosion, or whatever. But I wouldn't hate this mission if the spider bot wasn't so slow, man. This is so. This is like the most tedious mission, man. Come on. Like this mission is not enjoyable at all. Like, let's see. For the sake of my sanity, I hope I get out through here without a problem. Oh, sweet. All right. Probably switch my AK-47 probably because I did alert reinforcements and whatnot. Oh, there's a uh, tech point here too, right? There it is, yeah. Pretty easy to get to, I thought it was more tedious. Alright, I'm... Yeah, I'm, I, like I said, I'm used to Fallout. Because <laughs> I'm crouching to run, I think. I'm crouching to run, and in Fallout, the way I have my controls set up, I, I hold down, uh... The left toggle to run. So, uh, can we get out of here? Oh, yeah, sorry guys. Yep, I know. Okay, we gotta disable that before we get out of here. Don't wanna alert anybody else. Um, I guess jump over this. No big deal. Any parcel here? Nope. They in park here? No, not parcel. Here. Secret location. Sounds like another breadcrumb on the trail. I say we go deeper into the woods. I just hate how these missions are such two parters. Like you spent what ten minutes doing that with the spider bot in infiltrated building. Then you drive across the map. You don't get a waypoint. Come on, Ubisoft. Again, why do I have the waypoint? something that's already marked on the map. That's so stupid. Like... Are they that scared of being GTA clones or something? Like, like, oh, GTA, they GPS their waypoints, but we don't. We're different. Like, no, it's, it, that's like a standard for open world games. Just automatically just set the waypoint. Like, I get this, this is like an open world game in a sense where I don't have to continue this mission. I, I can easily not have driven here and just like found out, done something else. And complete the mission later, but it's like at the same time, it's like 
that's not. It's just so stupid. That was really easy. <laughs> oh, there's a guy over here. Probably getting shot by the cops. Well, I've been stopping a lot of your workplaces, but I didn't play to store your lunch too. And it seems our mystery officer is dedicated. And their dedication led them straight to the tone bar. Question is, why? The confusion is certainly enough to kill an asthmatic, but there may still be something useful enough. I hear the police on the radio. Oh my god. Could you imagine just like getting shot at when he's like trying to go through this? Oh my god. It, sh it should be like. It's so stupid. It should be as like. I can't even talk with the this cops in here. Everything implicating Arby and Clan K in the bombings. But I know Mary Kay's band of twats were involved. And they're involved in other crimes we can look into. Me and a few good mates are willing to go off for going after Mary Kay again. I never feel I'm a lie. Like, oh my god, these cops are like in my ear. It's like, as soon as I start something like this, like, I, I, I hijack the camera. I shouldn't have the cops on me, it's just leave. I hear the cops. I'm. Yep. They're gonna be right on my ass. Aren't they? So how are these working with Clan Kelly? How do the worst scum always end up in bed to get seen by the end of the day? Covers all of the unsavory bits of London. Tug on a thread, and it leads back to them. Clan Kelly and Albion included. Not dead sex style to sit back while people are being taken off the streets. We need to act. Inspector Lau mentioned Albion is running their part of the operation out of the EPC. Detectives like us call that a lead. Alright, nice. So I'm probably going to leave it off here because this, a lot of these missions are pretty long and tedious. I'll probably film, I'll, I'll film part four, like, part four is going to, is this part, will that be part four? Yeah, part four is definitely going to be uploaded, like, back to back with this, so if you guys want to watch that later, you want to watch that now, go ahead. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and uh, edit it right here before we reach a 20 minute mark. Like and subscribe if you if you did enjoy this. this. This is kind of a these were kind of boring missions and oh my god, but yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everybody.